I grew up in Furcrest. We lived on Columbia Avenue, which is the Furcrest side of, of on 19th Street. I went to Wainwright Elementary, which was just a few blocks from where I lived, and I would walk to school. My first job was to deliver newspapers after I broke my aunt's window. My mom made me get a job to pay for it. I still can remember it was $40. It took me months to earn $40. <laughs> I've lived here for 40 years. I've loved um, living here. Lori and I raised our sons here. And I just want to make this uh, community great for our children and grandchildren. One of my fondest memories was coaching my son's UP community baseball teams. Education has been a big part of my life, both professionally and personally. I went to the University of Washington, law school, and then I have taught at Northwest University. My mom uh, was a kindergarten teacher when I grew up, and she is still teaching kindergarten at age 85. My wife, Lori, is a teacher. She teaches at TCC, uh, English Lit. I had the great privilege of representing 8,000 public school teachers when their wages were taken from them without their permission and paid uh, for politics. And we won that case in the United States Supreme Court. Small business owners account for anywhere between 70 to 80 percent of all jobs. If we want to grow out of this recession, um, We've got to help small business owners. I've met a lot of teachers and small business owners and military families uh, in this district. I have two sons who are in the military. One is at West Point and will be graduating and entering uh, the Army next year. And then I have another son who's in civil affairs in the Army Reserves. Uh, military families are so important. They, there are thousands of them and they have given so much for our country. Um, we need to be supporting them and showing how much we appreciate their sacrifice. My name is Steve O'Ban. I'm your neighbor. I share your values, and I would be honored to have your vote.